What's going on guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today I want to discuss with you guys all the score streaks in Call of Duty World War 2. Now I was able to find gameplay footage of the score streak list, but I can't show them in the video, so I'm going to go ahead and link them in the bottom of this video. And uh, starting off here with the first one, we have the Recon Aircraft for 400 points, and this basically is the UAV from previous Call of Duty titles. And I'm not sure how long it's going to last, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be the same amount of time as uh, other Call of Duty games. And then next up here we have the Counter Recon Aircraft, and this is going to cost 420 five points and it's a fighter that destroys enemy recon or counter aircraft or blocks enemy recon aircraft so i'm not really sure what it means by blocking an enemy recon aircraft maybe if they have one called in then you can use this one and it'll basically negate that one so uh, i'm not really sure what it means by blocking but that's what it is it's basically a counter uav and then next up we have the flamethrower and that's going to cost 500 points and you guys might have seen a ton of gameplay footage of other youtubers using this and it does deal a lot of hit markers it's not going to be the same as the purifier from Black Ops 3, you do get hit markers. It does not kill on impact. And it also stays with you after death until the little meter runs out at the bottom of your screen. So that's pretty cool. And then next up, we have the fighter pilot for 525 points. And the description says, fly a strafing run in an aircraft. So you might have seen some gameplay of this streak a lot too. But pretty much you're guaranteed to kill if you use this. And then next up, we have the care package for 550 points. And you guys might uh, you guys probably already know what a care package is. And then we have the glide bomb next for 650 points. And this is the remote controlled bomb. It's pretty much like the predator missile. You guys might have seen that in the reveal trailer for the multiplayer version of the game. And the next we have the mortar strike for 750 points. And this is like the Black Ops 1 mortar strike. It's a precision strike on three target areas. So like I said, pretty much like Black Ops 1. And then next up, we have the artillery barrage for 850 points and I looked it up basically this streak is a plane that flies by and drops a bunch of explosives so you do use this on one designated area and uh, it definitely is going to do a lot of damage and then next up we have the flat gun for 950 points and this destroys all aerial aircraft and blocks the enemy from using streaks so it's kind of like the EMP but like a World War 2 version of it and uh, so yeah it might be kind of like the, the SAM turret from Black Ops 1 where it would destroy any streak that goes up in the air and blocks anyone from using any other streak and then next up we have the paratroopers for 1000 points and this was also in the multiplayer reveal trailer and uh, basically you call in paratroopers for reinforcements they do come in from the sky on the parachutes and i'm not sure if this is uh, ai controlled but it might be like uh, the support squad mates from call of duty ghost and the gi unit combined so i, I hopefully i do think it's going to stay with you and kill other people or defend objective just stuff like that that'd be pretty cool and then we have the carpet bomber here for 1200 points and it's an aerial obliteration bombing that makes multiple passes over enemy territory so that sounds very very deadly especially for domination because you you can use this bomber and pretty much control the B flag for uh, for as long as this lasts. And for the last score we have, it's called the Ball Turret Gunner, and it's going to cost 1,400 points. And the description says, occupy a B-17G and decimate enemies with its ball turret. And I'm going to have some in real life gameplay of the ball turret gunner. And I looked up a ton of information about the ball turret and I watched a few documentaries on it. And pretty much everyone says that this was one of the most dangerous positions to have in World War II. Because people compare the bubble that you're in to a mini coffin. Because you're so exposed to all types of gunfire. And pretty much if this plane goes down or if you get shot, you're, you, you really are fucked in there. You can't escape it. So very very dangerous very cool it is pretty much like the chopper gunner from modern warfare 2 and mw3 so uh, and black ops 1 so that is what it's like now the guys there might be some more streaks that weren't in this build of world war 2 and i'm pretty sure this isn't even the alpha version of the game it's definitely not the beta version so uh, they could add some more score streaks to this list i really am hoping that they could add a, an attack dog score streak that'd be pretty cool but i want you guys to tell me your thoughts about this list in the comment section below also drop a like if you guys did enjoy thanks so much for watching i'm a verts for girls of the day till next time I'll catch you guys later.